known Kate for many, many years. And we're always talking about art. She's always in my studio. And when she got the job at the garage, it seemed like the possibility of doing something here was there. And then she came up with this idea of doing the show with Goya, Eisenstein, and me. So when we saw those prints at that museum, it, was, it looked like they were printed yesterday because they had really had not seen the light of day. I don't think they have been shows, shown like once or twice, maybe. And this is the first time they're being lent, which is amazing. So the, how we chose those prints, we chose them like, we tried to choose them almost cinematically because Goya actually worked cinematically. I mean, now, said he said Goy would have probably been made films if he was he had a chance. But the thing is they're so he even numbered them sometimes. So we the thing is we have messed with history, which I think is kind of exciting. So how do we present three artists from three generations? It became a really challenging. So we decided we're gonna use we're gonna go for the etchings and then we're gonna do Eisenstein's films and then we're gonna use Eisenstein's drawings because we wanna use I thought it was interesting with Eisenstein, you have these big films, but you also have these really intimate drawings, which he has incredibly beautiful lines there. I think it's really important that you present work to a, and a viewer that you give the, you uh, believe that the viewer has a brain and can make their own, their own assessment. You don't want to preach to them. You don't want to say this is bad, this is good. You want to give, and somehow get them active in the thing. So the idea of, of showing them proof is saying evidence. So you decide what the situation is. Now I'm not telling you this is the truth or not, but proof is saying this is what's the, so the idea is as artists, we're trying to take the world and, and rip parts of it out and say, look at this. Take the time to look at what's going on. So I think it's really important, so. I know when we first started, the concept for the show was that there are kind of epic themes that we're looking at. There's war, there's religion, there's nature, and then there's the follies of mankind or the way that man seems to. So there's this, there are these big statements and there's these ways in which we can see across time periods and across cultures, across centuries. The title isn't about the artists themselves. It's not about the subject matter that each of you have chosen to do, but it is, it's the, it's the gesture, it's the, the kind of effort that artists are making to make, to give evidence to, like, that gets handed through time. So I think that's why the title works in the end. How do you say it in Russian? Svedetelstva. Svedetelstva.